Hospitals in the Triangle are getting creative to conserve vital IV fluids. Shipments were reduced after the nation's largest manuf manufacturing plant, which happens to be in western North Carolina, was damaged by Hurricane Helene. WRAL health reporter Grace Haba discovered some of the tools being used are the ones that you may have in your own home. Heavy rainfall in Marion caused a distribution disaster for Baxter the country's largest IV fluid manufacturer. Shipments to hospitals, including those here in the Triangle, have been reduced by 40 to 60 percent. I think it brings into really sharp relief how fragile the supply chain is for healthcare uh, as a country. To conserve supply for the most critical patients, Duke, UNC and Wake Med Hospital say they're now turning to things like Gatorade and Pedialyte more often for certain patients. We've had oral rehydration protocols in place Place and we're actually able to use those and implement that now. And, you know, trying to avoid, um, especially for pediatric patients, a painful IV stick. Because we oftentimes don't even have to think about the availability, uh, we, we are often ordering the fluid uh, when an uh, alternative strategy could work. Uh, so we're actually just using standard of care for things like very mild dehydration, where patients are able to take things by mouth, have minimal symptoms. Wake Med tells WRAL the drinks are also being used more often to hydrate patients before and after surgery when appropriate. The Baxter plant says its goal is to restart production in Marion in phases by the end of this year. Grace Haba, WRAL News.